Hello students, uh, today we are going to learn a technique called perspective. It is a technique we are using to create illusions of space and distance in our drawing. Now it gives kind of an effect of an object at a distance appears to be smaller and object near to us appear to be bigger. How can now I will show you how can you drawing how can you use this technique? So, first you have to understand what are the important uh, points in drawing a perspective. First, we will start with one point, one point perspective. Now, what is per one point perspective? One point perspective in all the perspective, you need one horizon line. This is called horizon line horizon line is a basically a, a, a line which defines your eye level this is your eye level so when you are standing in front of the sea you can uh, see one line where the water and sky is looks like they are meeting it's it's uh, kind of an illusion you can say now on this horizon horizon line we will make one point that is called a vanishing point where two parallel lines are looks like they are intersecting or meeting each other. So this line and this this these are called our perspective perspective lines now when this technique is used to create a 3d object how we can uh, create a 3d object is first same we will draw a horizontal a horizontal line here now on this line there is a vanishing point here, we will draw a different perspective line over here. Basically this technique is used to draw, a th uh, give a 3D object on a 2D paper sheet, see I am drawing a uh, square over here like this now this square uh, edges or corners of the square we will join with the with our vanishing point like this Now this gives you a 3D effect <coughs> now from here we can draw our cube by making straight lines over here vertical lines so how this is how it gives you the effect of a simple square is now turning into a cube by using this one line perspective. So this is basically this is how you can draw a cube. You can draw any shape when uh, by using this technique I'm drawing a triangle over here one more I will show you like this now here we have our vanishing point and this is our horizon line like this 
now this corner is touching to this vanishing point like this this corner is touching the, the vanishing point like this now if we just we just rub our mm, rub our <coughs> horizon line see you can see this gives you a 3d effect you can see a 3d object like this so basically the perspective is always used to make a 3d object or give 3d effect or depth or a distance of something we will see in our next next class how you can use this perspective or a one point perspective in your drawing